up you guys welcome back to my youtube channel my name is des i go by des b if you're new here hello and if you're not new here welcome back today i sadly do not have my normal intro because my computer decided to die so i don't get it back till friday and i'm really hoping that this video just still goes as planned since i don't have my normal editing stuff and whatnot but no matter what super exciting video for you guys today my favorite videos to do and that is a brand new buff bunny collection winter launch if you want to call it not only is the theme girls night in but everything is so athleisure a little bit of athletic only wear but a lot of it is things that you can wear out and about and really use the clothing in multiple ways and not just one the brand new launch is at 2 p.m est 1 p.m cst and 11 a.m pst i think the only one i'm missing is mountain time which would be one I don't know, not good at time, we'll put it down here. But as always, if you guys use my code DESBY, that shows support not only for me, but just shows them that I referred you, continues to allow me to affiliate with the brand, and I do make a very small commission on it. This video, however, is not sponsored. I don't get asked to do these at all, but I know a lot of people struggle with buying things online, especially athletic wear, when there's so many companies out there. Buff Bunny is my ride or die. I've been with them for almost two years years now and it's crazy to see the transition that they've made not only as a company but into just different styles of clothing into like i said the athleisure mode making very cute items for people inside and outside of the gym this girls night in and very comfy cozy launch is super exciting too so let's get into it so the first items that i have here and i'm trying on is the brand new dreamy lounge set this is very much what gymshark tried to do with their slounge set but 10 times better and i'm only using that as an example because it was a very hot collection and i think a lot of people did partake in buying that back you know what was it like a year and a half ago so these shorts the joggers as well as the top this is the color bear starting with the top this is very much kind of like a crop sweatshirt but the fabric is so breathable it's not see-through but it's very stretchy very lightweight honestly could be used as a pajama set however this is super cute to pair with like a chunky pair of filas or like a white nike air force and just really make like a cute outside loungy look to it this does come a little bit wider so i would suggest purchasing a sports bra to go under it preferably like a white color you do see i have like a greenish color on however this is going to be a little bit more wide neck so however you want to wear it is up to you and surprisingly these are long enough for my arms i have monkey arms so if you guys are out there too, this is monkey arm approved 100% as well as Desby approved 100% next up are What I'm wearing with it is the joggers the really cute thing about these is that these aren't sport joggers So these aren't gonna be your typical like sweat wicking joggers These are gonna be your walk around hang out lounge around girls night in joggers So they aren't thick material. It's the same material as the top very stretchy It does have 50% rayon 45% polyester in five percent spandex so it's a very cool blend that allows you to not have too much compression but allow you to kind of form to your curves and look really really good on the butt especially with these cute little pockets on the butt girls these are like a booty facelift same thing goes with the shorts honestly take the joggers and slice them right up to a short line these are what i would classify as booty shorts would i wear these out and about Probably not. Would I wear these around the house? Would I wear these to even bed? Would I wear these in between like going to the gym and coming back home like maybe after a shower at the gym? Absolutely. But these are a little bit shorter. They have a really cool crease on the leg which you can see in the video. So it kind of rounds to your leg and you won't get that weird like front, back, side to side, <laughs> awkward like side angle in there this set is by far my favorite set that is coming out in another color which is kind of like a grayish heather gray and i really love that one too but i'm a nude person so i like to see what i can dress it up in and use it for in different outfits next up is going to be the revolution bra and the new rosa leggings with pockets this color is in teal me more which 
their colors are always just so cute names so honestly props to them because I cannot think of all that the new Rosa leggings are super cool with the pockets so if you guys like you know putting your little gym items in there your airpods even your phone keys whatever when you're running in the gym these are gonna be perfect for you I will say these do fit a little bit differently than the normal Rosa legging and I'm not sure if it's due to like the different seams for the pocket not that they had to switch up a ton, but they do feel a little bit different. They still have that very much Lululemon Align dupe feel. This is probably the closest you'll get to Lululemon Align, and I'll I'll say that up and down, back and forth. I do really like this color, Teal Me More, as well. It comes up, cinches your waist really well with the leggings, and just makes you feel very flattered and very held in. This isn't like a compression-y spandex feel. It's more of like... It's not cotton, but it it hugs your curves like it does. It doesn't squeeze you in and make you look like a pancake butt. Next with the Revolution bra, I really, really, really love this bra. It's a different take on the Rosa bra in my opinion, and I like the cut a little bit more. So it comes out very wide on the sides, and there's quite a few beautiful colors coming out in this, but it just fits really comfortably. It doesn't like give you that bra bulge or squeeze too tightly under your lats. Very, very comfortable and has a really cute back obviously we have like a nice metal piece even to connect all of the back straps and like I said it does come around very comfortably doesn't squeeze anywhere and I would definitely wear this to the gym by itself you don't really need to wear a crop top with this unless it's outside of your preference but it does come low enough where it fits very nicely with these two together what else you see me wearing is one of my favorite pieces and this is the basic crop jacket in the color vanilla so this is a thick jacket do not be surprised when you go to put this on you're like holy crap i'm hot this is not your typical you know sheer crop hoodie this is very thick and nicely made i love the color so much the zipper works really well which i'm a zipper person if it ain't working i ain't wearing it it's very comfortable and i absolutely love that it cinches at your waist and just holds in in the spot that it's supposed to be. My biggest pet peeve is when I'm wearing crop tops and they're just moving around all over my body. So I absolutely love that this just tells you like, hey, I'm stopping there and I'm not gonna move. I absolutely love that. This is super comfortable. The hoodie, I will com confidently say, you're not gonna wear this hoodie. If you do, I would love to see a picture in it. In my opinion, the way I wear it, it's more so just to say, hey, there's a hoodie on the back. I'm comfortably gonna tell you guys I'll never wear the hoodie specifically, but it gives it a really cute and aesthetic look with the little Buff Bunny emblem right in the bottom, and it's just so cute and so quaint. I love that about the brand. It's just very minimalistic, but this is definitely one of my top pieces. So between the Dreamy set and between this, these are probably my two favorite things in terms of being able to wear these inside and outside of the gym. Dreamy collection meaning like going from the gym to home, not don't wear that in the gym, to be honest. Don't, please don't, please don't wear that in the gym. All right, these are also gonna blow your mind. I'm not that much of a jogger person. I don't know if you guys are, I'm not here to judge, but joggers sometimes just cut me off really uncomfortably. They make me feel a little constricted. I like to have my legs free. However, ever since Buff Bunny Collection has released like the Medina joggers and different style of joggers, I've come to really, really love them because I think that their brand fits me very, very well. So my favorite and brand new jogger are the Wonderlust joggers. This is the color Spirit. So I'm gonna be zooming in in the video when I'm wearing them, but they literally feel like the Rosa legging but in jogger and that to me is huge because they feel very very comfortable where I could wear these on a leg day high intensity day upper body day and feel 100% comfortable in them I love that they have the little different change in material here too I don't know exactly how to explain what the material change is but it's it just makes it all very very comfortable and I think this goes really cute with the basic crop hoodie 100% but overall these joggers are definitely probably on my high-end list if you're a jogger person I've tried plenty of joggers from different places I even own quite a few lululemon joggers and nothing compares to the joggers from buff bunny collection I don't get paid to say that but I'm just here speaking the truth Here's the next legging that I'm wearing. Gonna be very honest. Some people love this legging. They love the vibe legging and some people don't, and those some people are gonna be, to be honest, me. They take a lot for me to honestly put on. I don't know if it's just the material, I don't know if it's cause I just have bigger thighs, like smaller calves, but they're just not super comfortable to me. So 
If you like that sports spandex compression athletic wear, this is for you. I love that there's like no seams here at the bottom and they do rise up very well and squeeze the waist together, but I just don't like this material. I really just don't. They fit really nice. They are pretty flattering. They're squat proof as you see. This is the color Cabernet, but it's just not one of, not one of my favorite leggings. Now, will I wear it? On occasion, absolutely, you know, especially for a good leg day. They're very sweat wicking. You're not gonna feel sweaty and wet in these. But for me personally, just not my go-to legging. If you if this is your type, power to you, just not mine. The next bra is my favorite. It is called the Viva La Br Viva La Vibe Bra. Please try to say that four times. Viva La Vibe Bra. Viva La Vibe Bra. Viva La Vibe Bra. Okay, I got it. This is in the color Pillow Talk, which not only is like the cutest color ever, but it's also the cutest bra ever. I absolutely love, love, love this high neck look. It keeps the girls in. This is truly a good high intensity sports bra if you're someone that is a little heavier chested and definitely is gonna support more of a C and D cup very, very well. It has a really cute little mesh pattern here at the top, but it is very sturdy in the bust. And then the back is pretty, thin, it's not transparent, it's not mesh, but there's no extra fabric here that's gonna make it feel like a very heavy sports bra. This is also super sweat wicking, so if you're someone that sweats a little bit more in the chest area, which I know I do sometimes, my chest and like in between my back, ugh, this is gonna be really great for you. Again, you're not gonna walk out of the gym feeling super wet or like damp. It fits very, very comfortably. The color is absolutely adorable, and it looks super cute too. All about them gym selfies. Next up is the new Jacquard legging and sports bra in the color Mineral. So you guys have kind of seen this print before, but it is making a comeback even a little bit better. This legging, again, it is a very specific material. So if you're someone that doesn't like branching out and trying new materials, don't buy this because you might not like it. I personally love it. It's very soft. 86.5% polyester, 13.5 spandex. So you have a nice give to it, but you also have that polyester feel to it where it's gonna compress you very nice. Again, it's not like a sports compressive, so if you're someone that likes the Vibe leggings, this isn't the same material at all. But it is very comfortable. I like the texture and I like the pattern a lot. Some people aren't into patterns, so again, very much up to you. But the way that Buff Bunny makes their leggings, they're all gonna have the same effect with your waist, coming up very high-waisted, snatching it, oh, making you feel like an hourglass figure. Next, with the Jacquard bra, again, you've seen this bra before, but it's coming back, in my opinion, better. So before they had kind of this like knotty look to it last time that they released it, but it's coming back in just a really nice lower cut sports bra. I will comfortably say this is something you're gonna want, maybe your A cup, your B cup, you're pushing your C's and your D's if you're trying to like jump around in this. As you see in my video, it does make me look super busty, which is lit, but also not something I'm gonna be like doing heavy sprints or like burpees with it on. You're gonna stay held in, but you're gonna be bouncing a little bit. The back has a really cute look too. I have this double cross here, but then also has like a racer back look. So it's really fun. And again, I really love the material and I love the pattern. If you're a pattern person, this is gonna be right up your alley. And if you're not, don't buy it. So this is gonna be the shorts in the crop bra. I did wear these to the gym today, so they're a little gross. I'm not gonna really go into it that much, but they withstanded my full body circuit and I was dripping sweat and they were so comfortable. These shorts are kind of bringing me back to my volleyball days, the way that you wore your shorts during games, but then they have a really nice pattern and texture to them that are obviously different than like your Adidas spandex. I do love also that there's a little back pocket. So if you're ever on a run or you're doing something, you're just outside, maybe even with your dogs, you can shove your little key in there, your little AirPods pack and be on your merry way. So these are super comfortable, very high rise girls. We love that. We love that so much. And the crop bra, again, I was very sweaty. Okay, I was very sweaty, but I didn't walk out of the gym feeling wet. And that is one thing I hate about certain sports bras when they collect 
all the water and you just feel disgusting. This definitely did not do that at all and I'm so here for it. I did roll the bottom. So when I was at the gym, I took this thick piece at the bottom and I rolled it under. Personally, when I was wearing the shorts, the shorts were just a little bit too high and the crop was a little bit too long. So it looked like I was wearing a one piece. So I was like, no. So I rolled it, that's not a big deal. The back does have this really cool like mesh pocket. And if you're like on a run or something, just throw it back there. I know it's a little weird to think about, but you never know when you're in that situation and you kind of need it. Really cool, it does have that front zip, which I'm obsessed with because who wants to put on a sports bra, you know, when you're wet and you're like literally breaking your shoulders to get a sports bra on? This deletes all those issues. I really, really love this sports bra. I wish it had more just colors. I wish there was just bare, basic, like pink, white, you know, whatever, not just the jacquard, but you never know what's to come. We'll see, <laughs> reviewing. The jacquard jacket is the last thing to go with kind of the new jacquard set. I do love this jacket. This is super, super performance based. So if you're someone that's like a runner or you like to walk outside a lot, or you're just in between, you know, running into the gym just from your car, you want a little thing to warm up with and not be worried to sweat in it or get it like wet like a sweatshirt, this is gonna be perfect for you. This jacket has a really breathable mesh back, really, really long arms. Again, monkey arms checking in, and it does have thumb holes, which I'm so about that. I will say the one thing I don't like about it is that it's very, very long. It does cover your butt, so it reminds me of like the Lululemon tank tops where you buy it and you're like, oh, this is gonna be so cute, and then you have to, like it's meant to be pulled over your butt, like for yoga. Kind of the same vibe here. Will I still wear it? Absolutely. I probably just won't zip it because it makes it very apparent or I'll kind of maybe roll it underneath. Still a great buy. And if you're someone who doesn't like everything cropped, that you're gonna love this. I just, I'm a crop whore, so I just can't help it. I love it when things aren't touching under my belly button. It drives me nuts. Um, last thing I will say too, I forgot to mention, you guys saw it in the video, but the basic hoodie in the nude also has thumb holes. So. We're here for that, and it did reach my thumbs without ripping them back. We love that. So this next one is the Hero Hoodie in the color Pillow Talk. This is really, really cool because Buff Bunny slash Buff Bunny Collection actually collaborated with a local women's shelter to create this hoodie. They had them write down their favorite quote, and then they took it to print on this actual hoodie and a portion of the profits will go back to the shelter. And I think that's really cool and super empowering because not only is it a women's shelter that, you know, women have to wake up and go to sleep in and live in every single day, but they have this opportunity to be a part of something bigger than themselves. And also this is the comfiest just everyday sweatshirt that you could find. So again, in this really cute color pillow talk, there's other colors as well, but they have all the little messages on the base of the hoodie so you can read some of them um, there is no greater spotlight than the light from within you like so cute you are not your scars survive and thrive the worst is over meet the new you you are beautiful you can do this create your dream life today you have no idea how strong you really are grow through what you have gone through like just such cool little sayings from these women that are struggling battling, fighting every single day in this women's shelter. And so I think it's a beautiful thing that Heidi collaborated with them, allowed them to put down their favorite quote. I'm only assuming because Heidi's a saint that they literally got the sweatshirt themselves and then also a percentage of the profits goes back to that shelter. And I think that that is such a cool thing. So the last thing that we're gonna be covering is the falling freely dress, which is what I have on, and the brand new Teddy coat. This is in the color wine and then the jacket is in the color Moscato. Sorry, I had it underneath me because I was cold. <laughs> the dress, first and foremost, so cute. I know you guys probably remember the everyday dress and then the boss girl bandeau and skirt. Loved that. Very, very much a summer look, a summer vibe. But this falling freely dress is not only perfect for like an everyday dress, maybe to the office, out to a date, walking the dogs, pairing it with a cute pair of boots. It's very every season when like the bandeau and like the everyday dress kind of, you know, with the tank, it's a little bit more summer. It fits so comfortably. It really contours your body and just it makes it look banging to be very honest and then with that I paired my teddy coat which I was so shocked at the quality of this 
and not because I don't trust in Heidi, but because it's an athletic wear. We're athletic wear, right? But funny collection, athletic in the gym. But this teddy coat is unreal. Sorry, I'm adjusting myself in the monitor. But this is so comfortable. It has this really cool, I call it a saber tooth tiger tooth that you put in and it just, it looks so cute and very American eagle-y. Do we want to go with that? If you want to wear the hoodie, you definitely can with this one. It's super cozy. I could see like wearing a really cute scarf with this. I have worn it outside in sub 20 degree weather and I wore only this. Very comfortable. Was I cold? Yes, this isn't a winter jacket, but it is very, very comfy. The material, the, the everything is just amazing. I can't, I really can't even say much more. There is no thumb holes in this. Okay, but again, my arms are long enough to kind of hold it like Ariana Grande it and feel super cozy and comfy. So definitely a hot buy. I'll get to it in a second. Okay, I'm gonna be honest, way too cold to take this off now that I put it on, it's too cozy. So here's the rundown. This collection is straight up. This is probably, like I said, one of my favorite launches where I'm gonna literally wear every piece a lot. There were a lot of other launches where I just really liked the shorts or I just really liked the legging color. Or I just really liked the crop top style, but this launch is truly something for everyone and I absolutely love that. I'm definitely gonna get a lot of use out of these products. So what would I really recommend to you? If I had a top five, here we go, top five. I'm gonna give you it running down right now. Teddy coat. Number one, try to shove this sucker in your cart right away. These will go fast. Number two, the falling freely dress. Because I like the fact that you can wear it anywhere and it's very minimal branding, you don't see the huge buff money emblem and it's super cute multi-wear. Number three, the dreamy set. Honestly, both colors if you can, but I love the nude. Very athleisure, you can wear it outside the gym. So let's be honest, ladies, you have enough gym wear. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be the one to tell you that. You have enough gym wear, so get yourself some loungewear. Number four is gonna be that basic hoodie in vanilla. Love that. You can wear that all year round. Summer, cute high-waisted jeans, cute belt, hoodie over. I'm sold. And number five would definitely be that brand new Viva La Vibe bra in that pillow top color. Really any of the bras in the pillow top color because I am a pale pinker. I'm a pinker. I'm a pinker lover. I'm a pink lover, so anything pale pink, but those are my top, top things, because let's be honest, the rest of them are kind of, depending if you need it, okay? Lastly, I would say everyone should buy a hero hoodie because that deserves to sell out. These profits deserve to go to that shelter, and I think it's a beautiful opportunity to do so. To wrap the video off, let's finish with the accessories. The new Game Changer backpacks and the new Rosa headbands. These are all amazing. You guys know Game Changer Backpack. These will sell out right away. So if you don't want one, don't worry about it. But if you want one, you're going to want to worry about it. I have this in black already from last launch or two launches ago. I use it every single day. I really do. I'm, it's literally my gym bag. I will probably transition this more into an everyday bag because I just love the color too much and I like black because I can like sling it around the gym and it can get dirty. And guess what? You can't tell. The Game Changer backpacks are a little bit more of an investment, but you have to realize how freaking much it costs to make these. Insane. So I do love them. Now, the Rosa headbands are really cute. We have all the colors of literally the Rosa leggings. It's like a mini legging. I think it's so freaking fun. I'm not a big headband person, to be honest, because I have a cone head and I was born with a cone head because I had to be suctioned out of the womb. Don't ask me anymore. That's all I'm going to tell you guys. I will say that these are actually kind of cute. I'd have to play with this a little bit to like get it on my head, but even right now it's staying on my head. beautiful. So I do like them and I will probably wear them a lot more with like athleisure clothes, not necessarily to the gym because sometimes I just look like a boy in headbands, I'm gonna be honest. So if you guys are looking to get a few accessories, I would highly recommend 100% just up to you. But like I said, my top five are already stated. It's more of, do you want these accessories? Do you want this drip? Do you want a new game? You know, do you need a new game changer backpack? Do you already have one? Okay, I'm not gonna include that in my top five because you might already have it. And then it'd be a waste of a spot. 
I hope you guys like this video. Honestly, a little bit longer than I anticipated, but we have a lot of stuff going on. We have a lot of things going on, and I need to make sure that you all are informed. So as always, make sure that you use my code DESB at checkout. Supports me, keeps me affiliated, allows me to keep doing reviews because I have clothing to show you, and also I make a small commission. So this supports me, this channel, my opportunity to get a brand new ring light because your girl needs one, and I also need more YouTube studio. I'm trying to go hard. Hope that you guys have a great day. I'll see you guys in next week's video. Super excited to continue to grow with you guys here on the tube. Have a great day and I'll see you next week.